Hey folks, your OS Reviews, you're watching our video first look and a quick review of the Ring Spinner. This is a quirky accessory for any smartphone running on iOS or Android, and it combines the idea of an anti-drop uh, phone grip, uh, which you can hold and pop up at an angle as a phone stand, with the fidget spinner, which of course with a, was a popular trend several months ago. Uh, it also comes with a companion app that you can download on the Play Store or iOS Store, and it creates these very hallucinatory images uh, on your phone's display and when you spin it it creates of course the idea of um, a pattern kind of like LED fidget spinners which is actually pretty cool. Um, as far as pricing it's not completely confirmed. Uh, their website at the moment doesn't exactly mention it but it should be in the ballpark of roughly $10 to $15 uh, I would estimate and it comes in a few color iterations as well. You can see some basic branding information on the back and it's uh, showing it as far as centering it properly on a phone. Uh, so that the weight distribution is correct when you're spinning it round and round as a fidget spinner. Um, it works, of course, with any late, latest generation iPhones in addition to Android devices. So let's open this up and take a quick look at it. Looks like I'll just be using a 3M tape, which is relatively sturdy to be attached onto the phone or on a phone case. And then the build quality itself is made out of this kind of uh, aluminum material that's uh, kind of glossy and uh, feels relatively well constructed. Um, the ring itself can pop out like this, uh, which allows it to you know, be held onto one finger when you're spinning it as a fidget spinner or just popping it up as a stand uh, for watching media content. A jump cut, and I've now attached it onto the back of this Xiaomi device. You can see it's centered, and uh, the color actually seems to match pretty well with a kind of black colored phone. And you can see that it stays in place relatively well. You do have to apply a little bit of pressure the first time. As long as it's a flat surface, it should work. And then, of course, this part can kind of be a fidget spinner in its own right, where you can kind of flick it, and it will move for a few rotations. But more importantly, if you kind of uh, lift up the part that's the ring, and then you put it on your finger, you can now kind of uh, rotate your phone as a fidget spinner, which seems to give it a bit more extra momentum because of the longer kind of uh, arm. And that, of course, creates the effect when the app is launched with the corresponding images. Um, I can also, of course, just use it as a regular phone grip, which means I can hold it when I'm, my other hand is uh, preoccupied with something. and. Uh, prevent accidentally dropping the phone in addition to using it as a media stand. So that means I can pop it up at an angle like this when watching kind of movies on the go on a surface. So interesting that it has all of these different applications. So let's take a quick look at the app. Again, it's free in the store and it's simply called Ring Spinner. It has the same logo found on the company's packaging here. The app is actually kind of interesting. It's uh, is almost like a social media uh, hub in its own way, where the main page is uh, uh, populated with uh, users commenting on designs they found kind of interesting and demonstrations that they're using it for. Whereas on the bottom is where you can actually share your experience. You can start a rotation by picking one of these designs in the catalog. Uh, you can also upload your own image to, to try and play around with that and experiment. And you can also check out your own profile uh, after you've signed in. And so if we just tap on the main page here and just take a quick look at the first picture, and I can change even the uh, consistency, I can change the flash and have the flash turn on if that's something that you want, uh, maybe in a darkened environment, and we just start the, the show. So now it's ready, and now we can start the show. So indeed it creates a pretty uh, hypnotizing kind of design, especially if you zoom all the way into kind of the center here. And of course, all these patterns are generated by the screen and the rotations. And it does seem to actually uh, rotate as a fidget spinner for a longer duration of time than expected, um, especially since, you know, in that previous test that we saw, it doesn't spin that long, you know, as with its own ball bearing, but attached to the phone with this extra momentum, it seems to go for roughly almost close to a minute before it stops, depending on how, on how hard you're flicking it. Just quickly going through some other patterns on here.
Alright, so hopefully this gives you guys a good idea of uh, what some of the designs available look like. And indeed, if you have the phone's display on a bright enough setting and you play around with the flash controls, it does actually create a very hypnotic uh, experience. And uh, it works actually better than I expected and of course is pretty fun to play around with. Um, I would say that it definitely has quite a few utilities you know, going for it from being actually a pretty good fidget spinner, uh, you know, that uh, converts your phone into the fidget spinner in this case. The most important thing is it actually stays in place quite well. At no time did I feel like it was getting loose, uh, which would be, of course, quite dangerous. And the build quality of the spinner itself seems actually quite sturdy. Um, as a phone stand, it also works well for watching media, and at the same time, it does a good job of holding your pl phone in place, especially if you have a larger phone, like a 5.5-inch iPhone 7 Plus, iPhone 8 Plus, uh, or a phablet, and uh, using it with one hand becomes a challenge in certain circumstances. Having this to answer phone calls without accidentally dropping your phone could be actually a pretty smart investment and of course it uh, also combines the fun of a fidget spinner quite well. So you can check out more details in our upcoming article but for now this has been our video. Thanks for watching here at OS Reviews. This has been our video first look and a quick review of the ring spinner.